Now to a crazy story that we have watched play out now live for quite some time. Suits, wedding dresses, all kinds of different clothing items. They are slowly making their way back into the hands of Valley customers all at a Queen Creek dry cleaning business. It is now back open after being locked up for days. Notes had been left uh, behind for some of the customers, but no one showed up to open the doors until tonight. ABC 15's Mary Ellen Resenda is joining us now live. And Mary Ellen, you just got an update out there. What can you tell us about this? Well, we can tell you right now the line right now is out the door and down the plaza as customers are waiting for their items. This isn't quite as easy as they thought it would be. Many of the items were outsourced to other dry cleaners, and so they're not actually in the business here. Among those items is a bridal dress. We were inside as that bride was just so relieved when the doors opened. And uh, but once she was told that her bridal dress was nowhere to be found, she was just heartbroken. But they were able to find her dress at another location and she has raced out of here. Here's what she told us. Amazing. You think I won the lottery. I got my dress. I'm ready to get married. Let's do this. <laughs> I can finally enjoy this. <laughs> I watched as I was going live and you were just agonizing over here. Oh yeah, especially when they said they couldn't find it. That was just heart wrenching. Like I said, I just, I want the dress in my possession. That's all I'm asking. Don't care if it's done. I just want my dress. <laughs> we're going to rush over there though. <laughs> so we're crossing our fingers, hoping it is going to be the right dress for Miss Moreno right there. Now we do want to tell you that the owner tearfully apologized to all the customers saying that they went financially under. They were ashamed and they went into hiding, which was not like them. Today they opened their doors, although a lot of customers still not happy with what's happening. They did open their doors. Now the owner is telling us because the process is taking so long, they are going to stay open through tomorrow. So they are going to open back up tomorrow for those people who couldn't come in tonight. We're live in Queen Creek. Mary Ellen Resendez, ABC 15, Arizona.